Yeah, he got a malfunction. I might show up at his crib or maybe his job and had a whole staff jumping. Waiting on him at the studio, he come in, I cut the lights off, murder ink his ass and stab him. Even if he grabs something, the only thing he aim at is a sidekick. That nigga ain't gon' blast nothing. We make movies, dog. So check the credits. If I got a situation, then the whole fucking task coming. So the chances of me getting paid is half and half. Just cause I dropped out of school don't mean I'm bad at math. I get money, dog. What do you get? Soon as you figure that out, I'm on some new shit. Nigga, I do this in the bed with two tricks. Got an abracadabra and plus a Kalamazoo bitch. Cause I don't like not eating when I ought to be. But you force my hunger like aqua tea. Now you can take a nigga out the hood. Out the hood, out the nigga. We still squeeze trigger. With a shown in a Honda On Palaka Pole Boy See I was ghetto bread A nappy boy You couldn't get a comb Through my nappy head Pain I'm living on the edge I'm addicted To big booty hoes Cushion Chevrolet Get shoes And I'm infatuated With getting keys off I like my steak well With a side of rice peel off And all my dogs got choppers You know Yellow tape Helicopters You know Black bags Her they gave it to his black YouTube, that one ain't to you. You're back again once again. And today, we would say we are back for episode number 10. I think, no, it's episode number 9. Is it 9? I think it's episode number. I think it's 9. Is that or 10? I can never remember what episode we're on. But, anyways, we're back for another episode of our Pokemon X Wonderlock. In the last episode, you guys, we rode on the Rhyhorn all the way down to Glittering Cave. We went all through that bitch. Actually, I was supposed to go back through that in the grinding montage and scoop up the extra items that are in there, but I forgot to do that. Anyways, it's neither here nor there. But as you guys did see in the grinding montage, we did take on a couple trainers and we did use our experience share because a part of the rules of the Wonderlock state that we can use the experience share during grinding. And I promise you, all I do is fight the trainers along the way. So, let's go and get a quick party update before we get started with today's episode. As you can see, our party consists of just four lonely members as of right now. We have a Bibberol, or Al Bibberol. I'm so used to having them having nicknames. I want to say Blank the Bibberol. Bibberol the Bibberol. Anyways, we have a Bibberol at level 26 with Hyper Fang, Water Gun, Headbutt, and Roll Out. Then we got Flachinder at 26 with Ember, Roost, Roost. Get rid of Agility for Roost, even though I really don't need it because it's, it's smarter to just use a potion than to waste a turn. 
on Roos, because, like, Roos is not going to get you as much health back as a potion would. It's neither here nor there, but still, it doesn't really matter, because I'm not going to use agility either, so fuck it. But yes, Ember, Roos, Quick Attack, and Peck. Gotharita at level 31, which, actually, I didn't even touch Gotharita. I didn't even use it. Um, it leveled up just from the experience share, and it learned Future Sight as well. I think I got rid of Embargo, or some shit like that, but it's rocking the Future Sight, Fan Attack, Psy Shock, and Flatter. And last but not least, we have our Ivy Sword at level 28, with Sleep Powder, Razor Leaf, Leech Seed, and Growth. Now... I wish we got that Omni Coin. Not bad. Not bad at all. Now, I really don't know what our strategy for this gym is going to be. Um, really, I was relying heavily on our Frogadier that we lost a couple episodes back, which really, really fucking sucks. So, I guess we're going to rely on our Bib Roll. I know there's a couple trainers in the gym that have, uh, I think there's one that has a Relicanth or some shit like that. But besides that, we should be good to go because it's a rock type gym. I can't use Fletchinder um, because it's because Grant has the two fossils. Dragon type's going to resist Ivysaur's grass attacks. I could put it to sleep. If we really wanted to, because I know we'll live a hit. And Amora is going to ice Icicle. It's going to T-Wave us and hit us with some... some. Wait, doesn't it have like... Doesn't it have like refrigerator or some shit? Doesn't, is it going to turn... Uh, oh, it's got takedown. That's what it is. Yeah. It's got... um, Is it refrigerate? Is the name of the ability? I can't remember what the name of the ability is. But either way, it turns um normal type attacks into ice attacks. And it's got takedown, which is going to fuck up Ivysaur. So we're not interested in that at all. So really, I'd say either Gotharita or Bibbro is our best bet. So really, I just got my fingers crossed and I'm just gonna hope for the best. But anyways, we are here in Sillage City, where the second gym is at. We need to stop off here at the old bike shop and scoop up a bike. I don't know. For me, for me, I've always fucked this nigga right here. He's completely irrelevant. He's not getting a voice. I'm sorry, but I don't know. The green bike. When I played this game, uh, the first time I got a yellow bike. The second time I got a green bike, and it just felt so weird riding around on a green bike. So. Just Fuck the green bike. I don't want a green bike. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. Give me the yellow bike, and we're good to go. We're good to go, we're good to go, we're good to go. I actually don't think there's anything else worthwhile in Sillage City, to be honest. I mean, if you want to get a, what is it, Thwomper, the Steelix, or some shit, you can stop by and scoop him up. But what we want to do, because I'm OCD as shit, I need to go ahead and uh, register this bicycle. Uh, hello? Is it already? Did it just work like that? Oh, I don't get to choose because we only have one thing registered. Ah, sneaky snake. Sneaky motherfucking snake. I got it. Oh, dear. If you're here for the bicycle race, I'm afraid you're too late. The race is over and I took first place. I feel bad that you missed it. Here, allow me to give you this strength HM and consolation. If one of your Pokemon uses the move, it'll be able to push large rocks around. Nigga. Go wash your hair. Get all them rocks and shit out there. Ain't your mama teach you any better? Goddamn. However, if you want to use the move outside of battle, you first need a badge from the gym. I run in this city. I run this bitch. And I'm going to keep running. I'm going to keep running. Never, never run out of money. I'm a dog. On that note, I'll be waiting for you in the gym. Come challenge me at your leisure. That's so awkward that he just shows up and gives you an HM. Like, really, Game Freak? You couldn't have you couldn't played that out any better? That's just... Uh, ha, ha, ha. It's awkward, in my opinion. But what I want to do right now is I need to stop off in here. We did already get a capture for connecting cave. Fuck, I need strength to get that. That's the only reason I fucking came in there. I need strength. I don't... <sighs> we'll come back there after we get the gym badge. Excuse me, asshole. But what I want to do... Shit. <laughs> Shit. Okay, so what I want to do is... I want to scoop up these items real quick. I know there's a hidden item down there as well. I'm going to scoop that up too. Excuse... excuse off the bike. Thank you. Really? It's just... Expect <sighs> Wasted all that time for not a damn thing. And I know that there is. I'm pretty sure there's a hidden item. Like, there's a hidden item somewhere around here. I know it's somewhere. Oh, yo, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Remember, you guys, I was telling you, once you get the item finder, whip it out wherever you go. Dowsing machine, that's what it is. Not the item finder, it's the dowsing machine. Same thing, same thing. It just depends on what age you grow up in. I'm pretty sure. Isn't there. Huh. The fuck? XP, just chill in the middle of the fucking... I bet you that bitch dropped it. It's mine now, nigga. It's mine now. Anyways, fuck all this stupid shit. I want to get to this goddamn gym because I'm pretty sure the TM for... Air Cutter? Oh, shit. There's another item. Oh, see, damn. He tells me I got to get the items. But still, I think there's a TM for, like, Air Cutter or Air Slash or one of the two up there. And I got to scoop that up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And, of course, if you want to get the... Sachet or the whipped dream, whatever they are, 
for the two fairy types. You can get them here too, but fuck all that stupid shit. We are here for one reason and one reason only, and that's to get another motherfucking gym badge. And that's it. That is it. That's the only thing I'm concerned about. What up, Clyde the guy, nigga? Does he even have a name? It's not, it's not even Clyde the guy, because Clyde the guy is back in Universe. So what the hell is this motherfucker's name right here? Hey, yo, nigga, future champ, what's going down? This is the Rock-type Pokemon gym, but you already figured that out. Am I right, nigga? Rock-types are great, aren't they? Weak to steel, water, and all kinds of things. Now, check out that wall. You can climb it up if you start from one of them blue spots, nigga. Left, right, up, down, you need to climb every which way to reach the gym leader. Ha, <laughs> nigga, good luck. Okay, so, I'm pretty sure we, we checked in the last episode. I'm pretty sure that the gym leader, I think, grants his his levels are... Fuck, this is the bitch. No, I don't want to fight her. I don't want to fight her. Because I'm pretty sure that's the bitch with the Relicanth. And that Relicanth is annoying as fuck. Fuck that dumb shit. I'd rather fight somebody else. Give me somebody else to fight. I don't care. I'll fight every other motherfucker in this gym if I ain't got to fight that goddamn Relicanth. And I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. But I'm pretty sure his Pokemon are level 25, I think. So I think we should be right on par. We're not super duper over leveled, and we're not under leveled by any means at all either. So we should be good, but at the same time, we don't have anybody that's like ideal. Fuck this wall, we don't need to go up here. We don't have anybody that's like really, really ideal for the battle either. So we're just kind of stuck, scrubbing it up. <laughs> really, that's, 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 that's what we're stuck with right now. We're just stuck scrubbing it up. And this rising star, Manon. Who names their daughter Manon? What is, what is Manon? The fuck? Manning. Call me Man Man for show. Call me Man Man for show. My name is Rising Star Man Man, and I like to train Soul Rocks. Bitch, your name is Manning. Alright, so, I was actually going to say, before we, before we set our eyes on that Relicant, was that I'm actually not trying to train, I'm not trying to train, I'm not trying to battle too many trainers in the gym, and lucky me, I actually remembered, my short term memory is complete booty, but lucky me, I was able to remember to turn the experience share off, because you know, this will be one of them episodes where I forget and I end up just, oh my god, turn down, Soul Rock, Jesus Christ, maybe I should go battle all the trainers in the gym and get as much experience as I can, ah, 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 honestly, honestly, I think, it's kind of gimmicky that they made the fossils his Pokemon in this gym. We didn't revive our fossil either. I just forgot about that. We got to go back to Ambrite Town. We can screw up a capture for Silic City and then go back to Ambrite Town at the end of the episode if we don't get absolutely demolished in this fucking gym. <laughs> we can do that. And then, okay, yeah, that's what we'll do. That's what we'll do. That's what we'll do. So hopefully, hopefully, what am I doing? Why am I not going for Hyper Fang or some shit? Hold that water gun for me. That nice and powerful choice specs water gun. Side wave. We're gonna we're gonna eat that up, and I think I'm gonna heal and then go for that. Uh, holy shit! Turn down. Jesus Christ! Nobody gave you permission to do all that. I got an orange berry. I should give my Vibro an orange berry. Nice and bitch made. Nice and bitch made orange berry. Not bad. Not bad, mate. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Please don't go for side wave. Rock throw. Jesus Christ! Oh, you didn't do shit. You a bitch. You a punk ass bitch. 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 Hold this hyper fame for me. Ah. I did more than water. Well, no, nah, did about the same. Either way, we're gonna kill on the next one. Hopefully, this bitch can't get no more crazy ass side waves off. My lord, turn down. No, you know what? No, 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 no. Fuck that. I'm playing safe. I'm playing safe. Y'all can call me a bitch if you want. I'm. I was pissed. Absolutely livid. Absolutely livid when we lost our frogadier. I'm not about to lose Bibro either, cause Bibro's kind of husky. He got the most HP out of everybody in the party, so he could take a hit or two. He's eating it up. He's eating it up. He's eating it up. Behold this hyper fame for me. Are you kidding me? Jesus Christ. I guess it's a good thing we did heal. See, that only did about 20 points damage. But fuck it. Now, please don't miss, Bibberal. Get all your misses out right now. Make sure you come to this gym battle with your spectacles all shined up, all screwed, screwed up nice and tight so they don't slip off your face. Get that experience, bitch. Rising Star, Mon Mon, Man Man, whatever the fuck your name is, ain't nobody care. Ain't nobody care. I think, honestly, she's the only actual trainer you have to fight in this gym. I think everybody else you can avoid if you're lucky enough. But like I was saying before we got into that battle, I wanted to try and avoid them because, as I was saying at the beginning of the gym, we're right on par, we're right on level for Grant. Hello? Can I get a camera angle change? Look at this fat motherfucker. How you, how you twist so fast? Jesus Christ. How the hell you twist so fast? You fast for a fat white man, Jesus Christ. But anyways, you guys already know what I'm about to say. 
only you can prevent loss of save data. So make sure you save that game before anything important goes down because it would absolutely suck if we got into this gym fight or you got into a gym fight and some stupid shit went down. What I think I'm going to do right now is just for GP, just for GP, I'm going to use these potions. Because, I mean, it ain't no sense in selling potions because they do come in handy. And I can use these potions outside of battle and use the super potions in battle. So, oh, Jesus! <sighs> I'm still nervous. I'm still nervous. I know he leads with the Amora and he always goes for the T Wave. He plays like a bitch and always goes for the T Wave. Wait, 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 wait. Do we have paralyzed heals? Do we have paralyzed heals? Because this is a. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. This, this could be an easy situation turned terrible. I don't want to rely immediately on our Gothitelle because it is kind of sort of over level for this battle. Look at how beautiful and serene this backdrop is! My lord! Look at this! It's just, just so. Look at the, how are you gonna gym like this? I, know, I mean, I know it's built into the into like the mountain and shit, but goddamn, nigga! My lord! When they start giving black people fancy shit like this, must be new to me! Anyways. I've been waiting in eager anticipation. What have I been waiting for? For a worthy challenger to appear. It's quite an achievement to have climbed all the way up here. Very impressive, actually. I have a feeling that our battle will turn out to be worth the wait. I hope you will show me that you, that you, that, that, uh, that I can't talk, that your skill as a trainer surpasses even mine. Bitch, I already know it is. Let's go. Okay. Oh, God. I'm running in our second badge. All right, Grant. Go easy on me. We, we gave, uh, we gave homegirl back in San Luis City to work. So Grant, please, please have mercy on me. You got Namora. Don't be T-waving people. Please don't be T-waving people. Please don't be T-waving people. I don't need you to T-wave me. I don't need you to T-wave me. Because really, there's some more. I have nothing for this more. I guess I could just go out in Future Sight and just, just do everything. Question is... Uh, fuck it. I know it's going to go for T-wave first. So let's just let's just see what we can do with a Hyper Fang. Ha! Not a damn thing! <laughs> and there goes the T-Wave. How classic! But you know what? You know what? You know what? I don't think that's freeze-dry. I don't think that's freeze-dry. So we should be good. So even if it goes for that takedown, we should be good to go. Let's go for this Paralyzed Heal. And this thought is crossing my mind right now of... Maybe we should go for Rollout. Aurora Beam. You punk-ass bitch. You punk ass, we are eating it up, we're eating it up. That's why I wanted to leave with Bibbro, because I'm pretty sure, that was a crit too, because I'm pretty sure that we're good to go with anything that we have here. Fuck it, I'm going to go for rollout. Hope for the best. Hope for the best, bitch. Oh, the damage, the damage, my lord. I'll take, stop T-waving me, you ass. Jesus Christ, how they make you a gym leader if all you do is T-wave people? I swear to God, if I could call the paralysis right now, here comes that, 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 that takedown. Eat it up, eat it up. Take your little recoil damage, too. Take your recoil damage. If we can hit this, that's it, that's it. This Amora's gone. There we go. Bibber roll come through. Goodbye, Amora. Goodbye, Amora. Goodbye, Amora. Okay, so we're trapped in a rollout right now. And hopefully, either we get caught by paralysis and it stops it, or we have enough damage to do some serious damage to this tyrant, because I'm afraid... Ooh, yawn. Ooh, yawn! That's actually not bad. Hey, wait, wait, wait. If I if I make it forget rollout right now, will it stop the move rollout? <laughs> will it stop the move rollout? Question is, should I get rid of headbutt or hyperfang? Dude, fuck hyperfang. Why have I been using hyperfang this whole time? Headbutt is ten percent more accuracy. Just hyperfang has ten percent more power. Fuck this shit. Get rid of hyperfang. I'll, I'll roll with Yon, because you never know when Yon might come in handy. See, Yon would have come in handy that first turn, because we still would have gotten paralyzed, but then we could have put that bitch to sleep. We wouldn't have the damage that we have now, so... Fuck it! Fuck it! Okay, so Bibbero, I need you to either come through with this powerful Choice Bandit rollout. <laughs> oh, it lets me swap! Yo! It lets me swap. I can't... Okay, now, I know for a fact that I can't go out to... Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. I'm going to swap just to break the rollout. Because I don't want anything to happen in Bibbero. I'm going to go out to Ivysaur. And plus, you're going to get that Amulet coin swap in. So that's good to go. I'm like all super duper technical tonight with my battles. With my battles, nigga. My battles. All right. So that's going to break the rollout. And that'll give me a chance to heal. And I was going to say, I can't go out to Gothitel. Not Gothitel. Goth uh, Gotharita. Because I know he's going to be rocking Bite. And that strong jaw Bite is going to fuck somebody up. It's going to fuck somebody up. 
Ivysaur brought his spectacles, his dual monocles. There you go. Fuck, fuck glasses. I rock dual monocles, nigga. Dual monocles, nigga. Tyron is fast as he. Look at how cute he is. Look at him. I just want to just get him a hug. Look at him. He's just so cute. Ugh. Okay, so I don't think. <laughs> Grant, did you did you breed your Tyron? Does he have Ice Fang? Does he have Fire Fang? Huh? You got all that bullshit on him. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use Paralyzed Heal on our paper roll, and then I'm gonna heal it as well. And hopefully this little Tyrant, this little cute baby Tyrant, doesn't wake up because that would absolutely shock. That absolutely sucks. So please don't wake up. I need to heal. Let me scoop up. Let me scoop up a super potion. Allow myself to amuse myself with a super potion on my dinner roll. Not bad, mate. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Yeah, stay asleep, nigga. Stay asleep, nigga. Stay asleep, nigga. Knocker. I think the most he could do is be a strong jaw uh, bite to us. I know he resists, so all my attacks are gonna be neutral. So, uh -huh. actually, you know what? No, fuck this bullshit. Fuck this bullshit. Let's see this nigga. We will stall him out. Motherfucker, wake up. I want you to wake up so I can put your bitch ass to sleep. Wake it up. Rock tomb. The hell? Are you trying to slow me down for, bitch? What the hell I ever do to you? I put you to sleep. I ain't touch you once. I ain't touch you once, nigga. I ain't touch you once. Calm down. See, now I'm about to put your dumb ass to sleep again because you over here acting up. Ain't nobody got time for that. See, you a little badass. You a little badass, baby tyrant. I'm going to put you in line, bitch. Bite? Sean, y'all bite? Ah, nah, nah, nah. Oh, what? Stop it! Please don't miss. Jesus Christ. Go to sleep. Go to sleep, bitch. Go to sleep, bitch. So, we have the sleep powder off and the leech seed. We good to go. We just sit nice and pretty. Nice and pretty, nigga. Nice and pretty. Hey, a nice and pretty, nigga. Nice and pretty. Hey, a nice and pretty, nigga. A nice and pretty. Hey. Alright, so Ivysaur is not going anywhere. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to go out to Bibberol, because knowing that he's got Rock Tomb, Fletchinder is just sitting on the sidelines right now. He's the nigga at the end that's got the Gatorade uh, tub ready to go and dump on the heads of Ivysaur and Bibberol over here. Alright, Bibberol, I need you to come through. I need you to come through. Look, he looks so stupid. He looks like he has like house shoes on or some shit. Look at his back feet. He's like, oh, I just woke up. How's it going, guys? Hello. Ha ha ha. Alright, so I'm gonna headbutt this bitch. Headbutt! Ah! Nice and powerful choice band and headbutt. Nice and powerful choice band and headbutt. I mean, I could lock myself in a rollout again if I really wanted to, but I don't really need to get the job done. Actually, you know what? He might heal. He might. Oh, no, no, no. He's not gonna heal. He's not gonna heal. He's not gonna heal. Because he's gonna stay asleep, and the headbutt, even if the headbutt doesn't kill, Leech Seed will take. take ah! Leech Seed will take care of him. Leech Seed, come through! And hey, don't even wake up! Don't even wake up! Don't even wake up! Don't even wake up! Give me all that. Give me all that good lovey dovey heavy bullshit. And give me my badge, nigga. Give me my badge, nigga. Ah, give me my badge, nigga. Swag. 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 Let me stop. <laughs> Let me stop. Let me stop right now. You have proven to be a wall that I am unable to smell. Yeah, give me eight grand. Oh, we had the amulet coin. I was about to say, that's a lot of fucking money for the second gym. There are some things that seem out of reach no matter how hard you try. However, it's important that you never give up, no matter what the opponent or the odds. I can tell from my battle that you and your Pokemon understand that. To commemorate such an impressive show of teamwork, please accept the cliff badge. Nigga, look at that. It looks like, 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 like a cookie or some shit. Like, I just want to bite into it because it's got caramel and chocolate and shit and all up in that motherfucker. With the cliff badge in your grasp, you should have no issues working. Together with Pokemon up to level 40. Okay, so that's good. Because let's just know that our, our uh, Gothitelle, or Gotharita, well, I keep calling it Gothitelle. Gotharita will listen to us because that was one thing I was worried about. This even applies to Pokemon you receive from other people in trade. And that's not all. You also get this. Nice and powerful Rock Tomb. I want to teach Rock Tomb and Bulldoze to the same Pokemon. <laughs> he will outspeed every motherfucker on the field. Goddamn. It's Rock Tomb. With this move, a Pokemon can hurl rocks at its target, not only inflicting damage, but also lowering the target's speed and preventing it from moving. Now that you've become a master wall climber and conquered this gym, it's time you thought about how to apply your skills in other areas. Think about how you can improve yourself as well as the Pokemon that are always by your side. When you find the answer, that's when you'll truly be able to smile. Nigga, I can smile right now. Shit, give me some red velvet cake. I'm happy as a motherfucker. I'm happier than a pig in mud. I swear to God. I swear to God. I swear to God. Um, but you know what would be amazing if he gave you, if they went, what was it, like Gen 2? If they would go all the way back to Gen 2? Was it Gen 2? I remember, if they would go all the way back and, um, what the fuck, what the fuck was it called? 
Why did I go down here? Wait, do I even have anybody that has strength that could learn strength? I don't know. No, no. I'll wait. I'll wait. I'll get our. I'll get our encounters for this, and then uh, see what we get from Wonder Trade, and hopefully somebody we get from Wonder Trade will learn strength. But you know what? No, 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 no. Pause. 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 We have Bibberol. But do I want to teach Bibberol strength? Would I? Should I get rid of Yawn or Headbutt for strength? I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait just to be sure and see what we get first. But I do know that I'm gonna need somebody with Rock Smash. And I don't know if I want to teach anybody on my party Rock Smash just yet. So let's see what we got in the PC. Who do we have in the PC that can learn Rock Smash? Because let's see. Oh no, pause, pause, pause. I take it back. I take it back. Bring it back. Bring it back. Bring it, bring it, bring it back, nigga. Bring it back. Um, in the grinding montage, if you guys saw, we made our way through Ambrite Aquarium. And that allowed us to scoop up the old rod. So I don't even need Rock Smash to get an encounter in Silage City. We can just fish for this bitch. We can just fish for this motherfucker right here. Right here. So all these niggas that gave me some whack ass fucking uh some whack ass love discs in the last episode, I'm about to get a love disc and send it right back, nigga. About to get a love disc and send it right back, nigga. Alright, so give me give me give me a Pokemon. Come on, I got all day to be here, nigga. Really? Really? You gonna do this to me right now? After all I've done for you, you gonna do this to me right now. I didn't even I didn't even register this thing because I thought we were just gonna be good to go. They didn't even register that motherfucker. I hope we have Pokeballs. Holy shit. We should be good with Pokeballs. Give me some. Come on. I know, I know the love disc. There we go. I, say, I know these motherfuckers is out here. So this is our Silly City encounter. We're going to scoop this bitch up. And then we're going to make our way back to Ambrett Town. And revive our Jaw Fossil. And we're going to trade the Tyrant and hopefully this love disc as well. And yo, look at this. Look at this. Nice and beautiful yawn. Put the bitch to sleep. Put him to sleep real quick. Nice and drowsy. Nice and drowsy, motherfucker. Nice and drowsy. You ain't doing shit. You ain't doing shit. Turn down. Turn down. Turn down. Turn down. Turn down. All right. So hopefully, oh, we got plenty of fucking ball. You want? You want a netball? Water type Pokemon? You can have this netball. This netball got your name written all over it, nigga. Netball got your name written all over it, nigga. Hold that for me. Hold that for. Hold that for me. Send the ball. Send the ball. Thank you. Thank you. It is greatly appreciated that you chose to cooperate and work with us today. And thank you for flying Wonder Nappy Airlines. Too bad. That's what, they, that's what it's called when they when they go to Wonder Trade. They take off Wonder Nappy Airlines. But yes, you guys already know, speaking of Wonder Nappy, that's what we nickname all of our Pokemon that we're going to Wonder Trade off in this LP. So that if you guys happen to run into one, then you know it came from moi. And of course, before we, we ever go live, or go live, what the hell, I'm not live streaming. Before we ever record, I always tweet out, letting you guys know that I am recording currently. And if you guys want to hop on Winter Trade for a chance to be involved in the episode, then you can. So make sure you guys hit up that Twitter link in the description. And keep an eye out for whenever we are recording the next episode of Wonderlock. What the hell? I didn't even know she was here. <laughs> I thought I knew a good majority of the Sky Battle Trainer spots or some shit. I didn't even know this chick was all the way up here. Sky Trainer Aveza? Actually, what? No, I lied. I lied, I lied, I lied. I did see her when you're up on the northern part of Route 8. Up on the cliffs, you see her, but you never actually ever get to battle her. That's because this bitch is down here. Not bad. This is actually decent because I wanted to do a Sky Battle in, in, in an actual episode. Really, bitch? You could try and paralyze people up in the air. You know what's going to happen to my flat chin? He's going to hit the motherfucking ground because he can't slap his motherfucking wings, bitch. That's murder. That's murder. That's homicide. Is that homicide? I don't know exactly what homicide is. What's the difference between murder and homicide? I don't know. I don't know off the top of my head. I'm sure there will be one of you guys in the comment section that will know the difference. But either way, I'm going to look it up afterwards. What's the difference between murder and, and homicide? Razor Wind, I'm going to pass. Because ain't nobody got time for no two charm moves right now. Nah, nigga. Nah, nigga. Nah, nigga. Swoobat. Jesus Christ, talk about the war- Oh wow, we only have one Pokemon. Huh. I wonder, I wonder, how do Sky Battles work? In the sense of a Nuzlocke, how do Sky Battles work? Because... Technically... If we black out... Because technically you quote unquote lose your lock if you black out, right? But our party's been reduced for this one battle. Not our entire team. Our entire team is still here. So that's interesting. That's interesting. I'm going to go ahead and heal right now. Because this is scary crit range. 
And ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. So here, have this, have this, hold on to this. And it's crazy that this Subat outspeeds us too. Like, what the fuck? We're a clean five levels above this bitch. And it's outspeeding us like, it ain't no damn fine, nigga. I think it's... Is it air cutter or air late? That's a crit! Calm down! Jesus Christ! Okay, so we weren't in crit range, but still. Is it air cutter or air lace that's up there in the connecting cave? It's one of the two. I know it's up there. It's the one that you need for Malamar, for a competitive Malamar. I'm pretty sure it's Aerial Ace. I'm pretty sure. Alright, I'm gonna put it all on the line. Put it all on the line! Quick attack this bitch! Ah! Just enough damage. Not bad. Not bad, not bad, not bad. This is actually an impromptu battle, but I'm glad I did, because like I said, we had a lot of sky battles, or we had a couple sky battles, and then grinding montage for today's episode, but I actually wanted to get a sky battle in an episode, so thank you, Sky Trainer, Azalea, whatever the fuck your dumbass name is. Leave me be! Anybody got time for your dumbass? That was completely on accident. Whoops. Whoops. But alright, we need to head back up here and revive this fossil. I'm actually going to... Actually, no, I don't even need to do that. I don't even need to do that. I was going to say, I'm going to go heal. I don't even need to do that. Not even necessary. Right? Not even necessary. Because that's... Uh, our bib roll is ahead of our party as it is. That's just for sky battles. And as far as I know, I'm not planning on doing any more sky battles as of right now, so... Fuck the stupid shit. Fuck the dumb shit, nigga. Fuck the dumb shit, nigga. Fuck the dumb shit. Alright. Bring me back my jaw fossil, nigga. I got one of trades to do. I got one of trades to do, and I need to get some decent Pokemon. I need to get a Pokemon that can re replace my frog a deer. That's what I really, really need. I need a Pokemon that can replace my frog a deer because I'm crying. I'm crying. I'm crying, nigga. I'm crying. But of course, this one's going to be named Wonder Nappy as well because we got to Wonder Trade this bitch off. Wonder Trade this bitch off. It's female. It's nice and female. It's nice and female. So let's go ahead and check out. Oh, fuck the love disc. Ain't nobody care about what the love disc stats are. But we know what, we know what moves it's going to have. Nice and powerful fairy type move. Wonder Nappy, nice and neutral nature, not bad, not bad, not bad. Stealth Rock, so if you want to do a nice and powerful competitive Tyrantrum, that's your chance <laughs> with the neutral nature. All right, so we're going to go ahead and log on to Wonder Trade right now and see what the hell we can do, see what the hell we can get. We're going to want to trade the Love Disc off first because we caught that one first, and hopefully, 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 it would be so... Is the word ironic? Is the term ironic? Or, or I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. It would be so great if we got some sort of power for the love disc. Because as you can see, we got a fucking love disc in the last episode. So stupid. But let's go ahead and wonder trade this bitch off. Nice and naughty. Ugh, find somebody that, that's that's pokey rich. Find somebody that is Pokemon rich and has some amazing Pokemon. Like the Eevee that we scooped up in the last episode. Which I will have an update for you guys here momentarily about that Eevee. Because a lot of you guys left suggestions for what we should evolve that Eevee into. V! Oh god, that's scary as hell. Orange is the new black is coming back to haunt me! Alright V, I know you got people working for you. Give me something good V. I got my eyes closed V, give me something good. V, I need you to give me something good. V, look out for me, V. Ugh. You son of a bitch! God damn it! I mean, I can't, like, I can't be super mad at that because Vivalon is power. Vivalon is power. You don't underestimate Vivalon in any way at all. But still, that's... Not what I was looking for. I want some exotic Pokemon. That's what I'm looking for. Some exotic motherfuckers. All right. So Wonder Dappy, our nice neutral natured Tyrant. Look at how cute he is. Oh, he's just so cute. I love him. 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 All right. So we're gonna want to trade him off and see what we can scoop up for him. Hopefully we can get something decent. Hopefully we can get something decent. Not a fucking scatter bug. Okay, Ching Ching Chong from Seoul Subayolosi, South Korea. So oh, I was gonna actually try and read it again, but oh well. Alright, here you go. I'm gonna trade you just some little Korean people. I feel so bad. Not because they're Korean, but just because I'm a part with you. I'm not racist, I swear to God. Anyways, give me something good. Give me something good. I have a Korean Landorus, so I know y'all niggas got some good shit. I'm fucking Fletchling! Actually, you know what? No, 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 this is good, 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 this is good. Because this falls under our dupes clause. If you guys aren't sure what our dupes clause is or the rest of the rules for Wonderlock, they are listed in the description. But basically, if we get a duplicate Pokemon in return for Wonder Trade, we can then Wonder Trade it back off. So we have another chance. 
We have another chance at something decent. I'm sitting here trading off power. Powerful Tyrant. And I get a fucking Fletch thing in return. Hasty with big pecs. Man, nigga, fuck you. How's that? Nigga, fuck you. Alright, want to trade this bitch right back off. It's level one, so it's bread. So it's a reject. It's a reject. It's a reject. Alright, find me somebody good. Find me somebody good. Find me somebody good. Damn it. I want somebody good. I'm gonna get some these motherfucking Pokemon. All right, so now we we uh, we okay. Ching slash Song from Hokkaido, Japan. Come on now. I know when it comes to Pokemon, the Japanese people got the best shit. The Koreans they got that, like that bootleg shit across across the bay, across the sea. They got that bootleg shit that Japan. That shit that Japan was like, I don't need that shit. And it goes over to Korea. I'm just joking, but still, give me something good. Give me some power. Give me some power. Oh, not even bad, a frillish. Not even bad, yo. Not bad. That's like the exact opposite of Bibberol. Because one's normal water, the other is ghost water. Not even bad. I'm actually really, really... I'm actually really, really hyped to see... Ooh. And V and the acquaintances, I guess... I don't know, how can she see? She just said shiny Eevee. She's talking about my Eevee? V, I'm gonna need you to get the fuck about my PC box before I have to... You better check yourself before you wreck yourself, nigga. That's all I know. But, all right, let's check out Let's check out our trade and see what we got here. Because, I mean, I was sitting there shitting on the Scatterbug, but if it's decent Scatterbug, I might have to end up using it. It's not. It's just bullshit. Anyways, let's see here. Level 1, Calm, Water Absorb. That might be power. That might be power. That's got potential for power. Bubble, Water Sport, Confuse Ray, and Recover. That's got serious potential for power right there. I'm not even lying. And it's got a uh, calm, so special defense boosting nature. That's actually not bad. That is actually not bad. I'm actually very, very happy about that because Jellicent is bulky as a motherfucker. Huh. That's interesting. That's interesting. That's interesting to see. So, I have a lot of decisions that I need to make right now for the future of our party here because as you guys can see this is our shiny Eevee nice and neutral nature it's rocking the ability capsule <sighs> 6 IV as well or we're hoping it's 6 IV I think what I've decided that I'm going to turn this into is a Sylveon because we it, it, especially in those likes it's always good to have some sort of bulk on the team and at the same time I've never actually used a Sylveon period I was thinking about it. I've never used it in a Let's Play. I've never used it in a Wi-Fi battle. I have. Actually, as a matter of fact, I have an Eevee, a competitive Eevee ready to go. I just need to take the time out and uh, get that bitch trained up into a Sylveon. But I think we're going to train into a Sylveon. Even though it's got a nice and neutral nature, Shiny Sylveon is on the way. When we're going to get it, I'm not 100% sure. But we'll see. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Because we'll I don't have to level up to, like, level 18 or 19 as it is. So it learns a fairy move, and I gotta take it into Pokemon of me, and bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. But either way, we'll make it happen. In the next episode or so, we'll make it happen, we'll make it happen, we'll make it happen. I'm gonna go ahead and make my way back to Silly City now. But if you guys enjoyed today's episode and the intense second gym leader fight that we had, make sure you guys smash the hell out of the like button down below because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. And I just gotta say, the support on this series so far has been completely outrageous just mind blowingly mind numbingly mind bottlingly insane so i want to thank you guys i'm so glad you guys are enjoying this series so far so i just i just gotta say thank you thank you so much and like i said if you're enjoying the series make sure you smash that like button down below for us and of course thank you for checking out today's video don't forget tomorrow we have a, a, a bonus episode for this week because we missed out on wednesday so episode 10 will go up tomorrow and of course episode 3 of the blaze black vote white 2 co-op egglock is the first link in the description because I went up over on Calum's channel today, so make sure you check that out as well. But with that being said, you guys, thank you once again. You can meet me to that 182. I'm out.